Good morning, everyone. Happy Tuesday. Although I don't know how happy a Tuesday could be, being that it's uh, so early in the week. I know, coming off the weekend sucks, but what are you going to do, huh? Anyway, hey, we're going to go over the action from uh, baseball and softball this last weekend. Had some good series going, good games, some crazy stuff that happened. We'll talk about that. Got a lot of not news items to uh, get to, so we'll go ahead and start with that. Before we start, hit that subscribe button down there so you don't miss anything. With that, let's get started. Do uh, you remember the Iowa athletes that were busted for betting well, um, last season? Well, they are now filing a lawsuit claiming their constitutional rights were violated when the investigating agency um, broke into their cell phones for the investigation. Hey, they were all underage betting, betting on stuff they shouldn't have, so... It is what it is. Take your lumps. Move on with your life. Go for it. Uh, Baylor basketball player Myra Little. He's entering the transfer portal. UAB says their entire football roster has signed up for the new Players Association. Has to do with future revenue sharing and all that. My question is, what's going to happen if, let's say, a lot of these teams don't think they're getting a, a lot of these players don't think they're getting a, share, a fair shake? And decide, hey, we're not going to play this weekend. And then we're without college football. Uh, unions are good for some things. Uh, they screw up a lot of other crap. They do. I'm telling you, one of these days we're going to tune in. We're going to have one, two college football games one Saturday. Because everybody else is going on strike. I guarantee it. Watch. Uh, Appalachian, this, I don't know what happened here. Appalachian State offensive lineman Jack Murphy. Uh, he died Friday. Um uh, University gave no cause of death. They did say it wasn't foul play, uh, but they're not releasing what happened. But anyway, uh, man, sad story. Guy's probably in his early 20s. Prayers to him and his family and friends and co and uh, team members. Man, that's, uh, that, that's, I don't know what happened there, but that was, that was a sad story. Uh, Colorado running back Dylan Edwards. He's looking to transfer to Kansas State. Dion says when his sons are drafted next year in the draft, 2025 draft, um, he won't follow his sons to the NFL. He's got uh, still, he's still got work to do at Colorado. Does anybody want Dion? I mean, you're going to have a circus. Your, your whole organization is going to have a circus. Uh, I don't know if I'd want him coming into my NFL team for something. I mean, I don't. That's just me. I mean, it seems like a whole circus is going to follow him. Anyway, former Oregon State star running back Damian Martinez. He is going to transfer to Miami. Uh, rushed for 1,185 yards and nine touchdowns last year with the Beavers. Uh, UConn, they landed St. Mary's transfer guard uh, Adrian Mahoney. He's going to go to UConn. Florida Atlantic, um, let's see if I can say his name right, Vladislav Golden. Vladislav Golden um, helped FAU get to some really big heights these last couple of basketball seasons. Was going to go to draft. He withdraws from the draft and says, hey, I'm going to go to Michigan. Um, must be an NIL deal because why would you leave for a team that's done so well the last couple of years to a team that's not really that good? Got to be the money. Uh, let's see what else we got. Power forward Andrew Carr. Transfer some Wake Forest to Kentucky. Uh, we'll talk about a stab in the back on this next one, man. A lot of pissed off people. Stanford guard uh, Andrej Stojovic. Stojovic? Stojovic. Uh, Stanford. He's going to transfer to the rival Cal. <laughs> man. Uh, talk about a stab in the back, huh? That's just a lot of pissed off people there in Palo Alto. And BYU star wing Jackson Robinson, he decides he's going to enter the transfer portal. All right, so let's go back to Friday. Go through some of these scores and things that happened real quick. Um, Friday, baseball, number one, Texas A&M beat number 20, Georgia, 5-2. Appeal for A&M, two-run home run. Number two, Arkansas beat Florida, 2-1. to one. Arkansas Smith, 11 strikeouts. Nice game for him. 14 total between the Arkansas pitchers. Uh, number three, Tennessee beat Missouri 3-2. to two. 
uh, Beam for Tennessee. He threw eight strikeouts. Number 24, South Carolina beat number four, Kentucky, six to five, despite committing two errors. Um, South Carolina, their players hit three solo home runs. Number five, Clemson beat Louisville, 12 to 11. Uh, Luke Clemson's, how you say it? Uh, Beseda? Big Seda? B Seda? RBI single and a two run single in that game. Number 10, Florida State beat number six, Duke, 4 to 2. Duke did have four more hits in this game, but still lost. Uh, number seven, East Carolina beat Memphis 14 to nothing. Memphis, one hit in that game. Number eight, Wake Forest beat Notre Dame 4 to 3. Burns for Wake Forest, 14 strikeouts. Hell of a game for him. Um, Rinsish, Rinsish, two-run home run for Wake Forest. Number nine, Oregon State beat number 22, Oregon 2 to nothing. Oregon, only one hit in that game. Uh, number 11, Vanderbilt beat, number, beat uh, 27 to 15, Mississippi State 4 to nothing. Mississippi State, only two hits in that game. Number 12, UC Irvine beat UC Riverside 15 to 1. Troy beat number 13, Coastal Carolina, 8 to 6. Number 14, Virginia beat Boston College, 4 to 3. Number 15, North Carolina beat 26 and 13, Virginia Tech, 8 to 1. Virginia Tech committed four errors in that game. Number 16, Arizona beat Washington, 3 to 2. Washington did have two more hits, but they also had two more errors. Uh, number 17, Louisiana beat Southern Miss, 3 to 2. Number 18, Oklahoma beat 25 and 18, Texas, 9 to 4. Even though UT had two more hits and five more errors, Oklahoma, Oklahoma won that game Friday. Wait to see what happens later in the weekend. Uh, number 19, Oklahoma State beat BYU 11-5, then beat them 12-5 in a double hitter. Number 21, NC State beat uh, Ball State 10-2. Uh, NC State's McCurwitz, Grand Slam, nice. Uh, 23 and 19, Ole Miss beat number 23, Bama 9-8. Ole Miss's Furnace. RBI double and a solo home run. Uh, Southern Illinois beat number 25, Indiana State, 3-2. to two. Boy, Indiana State, baseball and basketball, finally break into the rankings and they start losing games. I don't know what's going on there. I don't know about softball. Let's see about them. 25-13, Illinois beat 26-17, Maryland, 7-4. 20-17, Penn State beat Minnesota, 7-3. Both teams had two errors in that game. 24-18, Cincinnati beat... 25 and 14 Central Florida, 9 to 4. 23 and 18 Indiana beat 24 and 17 Rutgers, 8 to 3. Both teams had seven hits in that game. 19 and 22 Miami. That's crazy, Miami. Such a historic baseball program. 19 and 22 this year. Uh, they beat 25 and 15 Georgia Tech, 6 to 4. 24 and 6 West Virginia beat Baylor, 18 to 5. Baylor, four errors. West Virginia's Chumley hit a three-run triple in that game. Baylor, another good baseball team that's not so good. 23-15, uh, Kansas beat 29-15, Texas Tech 4-3. Uh, Kansas says Hartle, solo home run and an RBI single. 26-13, Nebraska beat 23-16, Iowa 7-4. 25-15, TCU beat 25-16, Kansas State 12-0. Uh, TCU had a total of 18 hits in this game. Kansas State only had five hits in that game. Uh, wrapping up Friday in baseball, 27-16, LSU beat Auburn 5 to nothing. LSU had nine hits in that game. Uh, Molasso, two-run double for the Tigers. 27-15, Purdue beat Northwestern 9-3. 27-13, Utah beat UCLA 3-2 in 12 innings. Uh, Bruins, three errors in that game. 18-21, Stanford beat 25-15, Cal. Eight to six. Uh, softball on Saturday, twenty six to twenty. Notre Dame beat fifteen and twenty one. Boston College three to two. Um, I think that was uh, I think that was Friday night. I think uh, or uh, something happened because I don't know if it was like a late Thursday game or something. They finished it up Friday, but anyway. Notre Dame beat Boston College 3-2. Uh, number one, Texas beat Iowa State 5-2. Number two, OU beat 28-19. and 19. Central Florida 10-2, despite committing three errors. Um, Central Florida, only one strikeout. Man. Uh, number three, Tennessee beat number 17, Alabama 5-0. Pooney for Tennessee. She had a two-run home run 
Bama, three hits, two errors in that game. Number four, Oklahoma State beat Kansas 5-2 and then 6-5 in a double hitter. Number five, Duke beat 27-21 NC State 4-3. Number six, UCLA beat number 20 Arizona 10-2 in five innings. Number eight, Stanford beat number 10 Washington 3-1. Number 13, Arkansas beat number seven LSU 2-1. LSU only had three hits, but they also committed three errors in that game. 24 and 20, Syracuse beat number 15, Virginia Tech, 2 to 1. Number 12, Florida beat number 9, Georgia, 9 to 1. Uh, Florida's Brown and Wallace hit two on singles each. Pay attention. Remember in your head, Texas and OU, we mentioned earlier. Remember Florida, Georgia softball here in a minute. You'll see if you didn't see the game. Uh, number 16, Florida State beat 30 and 17, North Carolina, 13 to 3. Florida State had 14 hits in that game. Number 19, Louisiana beat UNL Monroe 5 to 4. UNL Monroe did have more hits in that game, but they also committed more errors. Number 21, Clemson beat Louisville 6 to 5. Southern Miss beat number 24, Texas State 9 to 3. Number 25, Cal beat Arizona State 11 to 7. Uh, Arizona State, three errors in that game. 30 and 19, Rutgers beat Michigan State 3 to nothing. Uh, 35 and 14, Michigan beat 33 and 13, Penn State 2 to nothing. 25 and 15, Auburn beat Ole Miss 2 to 1. 36 and 13, Indiana beat uh, Wisconsin 6 to 5. 28 and 17, Ohio State beat Illinois 3 to 1. 31 and 20, Georgia Tech beat 30 and 17, Virginia 6 to 5. 30 and 9, Northwestern beat 27 and 20, Nebraska 6 to 5. Nebraska more hits, but more errors in that game. 27-16, Texas Tech beat Houston 7-6. Both teams had 12 hits and one error in that game. 28-19, uh, Baylor beat 26-22, BYU 14-4. Hot for Baylor, Grand Slam. Pillen had a three-run single. Baylor swept BYU. Uh, Oregon State beat 29-18, Utah 4-3. Clark for Oregon State, three-run home run in that game. Uh, let's see what we got else here. Going to Saturday. Saturday baseball. Oops, no more. Uh, number one, Texas A&M beat number 20, Georgia, 19-9. to nine. Uh, They played the second game because we had some bad weather this weekend here in Texas. I think that's why they played the second game. Uh, they did lose it 5-4, to four, but the Aggies ended up winning the series. Number two, Arkansas beat Florida 6-5. Lost the second game, 9-5. to five. Um, The whole bad weather was going up there. You saw the tornadoes in Oregon and, or in uh, Oklahoma and Kansas and all that. There's just a whole system going going right through Texas all the way up there. So a lot of these teams, baseball teams, they played uh, double hitters up in that little region right there. Number three, Tennessee beat Missouri 3-2. to two. Uh, Curly for Tennessee, two-run single. UT actually, uh, Tennessee actually swept that series. Number four, Kentucky beat number 24, South Carolina, 15 to 13. Uh, Kentucky's Nicholson, two solo home runs. 25 and 17, Louisville beat number five, Clemson, seven to six. Clemson committed two errors in that game. Number 10, Florida State beat number six, Duke, seven to six. Duke did have three more hits. Number seven, East Carolina beat Memphis, 14 to three. East Carolina, 20 hits in that game. Uh, 21 20, Notre Dame beat number eight, Wake Forest, 11 to three. Uh, no Dames Marino, two run and solo home run. Number nine, Oregon State beat number 22, Oregon, four to two. 28 and 15, Mississippi State beat number 11, Vanderbilt, seven to four, despite committing two errors. Uh, number 12, UC Irvine beat UC Riverside, 15 to seven. Both teams had 13 hits in that game. Troy beat number 13, Coastal Carolina, 11 to four. Coastal Carolina is one of those teams that got ranked, and uh, man, they just keep losing. <laughs> this is crazy. Uh, number 14, Virginia beat Boston College 4 to nothing. Virginia actually won that series 2 to 1. Number 15, North Carolina beat 26 and 14. Virginia Tech 6 to 3. No errors in that game. Zero errors for both teams. Uh, 15 and 20, Washington beat number 16, Arizona 4 to 3, despite Arizona having more hits in that game. Uh, let's see, where are we? Southern Miss beat number 17, Louisiana 3 to 2. Number 21, NC State beat Ball State 9-3. to three. Uh, Ball State, though, even though they scored three runs, they did have nine hits in that game. Number 33, Alabama beat Ole Miss 10-3. Uh, LeBron for Alabama, two-run home run. 
Bama won that series 2-1. to one. Number 25, Indiana State beat Southern Illinois 9-7. to 19-19, Minnesota beat 20-18, Penn State 5-4, to four, despite committing two errors. 24-18, Indiana beat 24-18, Rutgers 12-6. to six. Zero errors again. No errors from either team. 27-17, Maryland beat 25-11, Illinois 9-8. to eight. Uh, Illinois did have four more hits in that game. 28-15, Purdue beat Northwestern 10-7. 26 and 15 TCU beat 25 and 17 Kansas State 7 to 4. Uh, TCU's Arthur hit a two run double on that one. They played the second game. Kansas State ended up beating TCU 6 to 3. Uh, 25 and 16 West Virginia beat Baylor 5 to 2. West Virginia's Clark, eight strikeouts for him. Uh, 24 and 15, Kansas beat 29 16, Texas Tech 11 to 2. 28 13, Utah beat UCLA 7 to 3. 26 and 15, Georgia Tech beat Miami 9 to 4. Uh, Georgia Tech's Bichetti, two run single on that one. Uh, 26 and 14, Central Florida beat 24 and 19, Cincinnati 5 to 2. 19 and 21, Stanford beat 25 and 16, Cal 15 to 6. Stanford had 19 hits in that game. And 28-16, LSU beat Auburn 3-2. Going to softball Saturday. Number one, Texas beat Iowa State 8-0, to nothing, then 9-1 to one in the second game. UT actually sweeped them 3-0. Uh, number two, OU beat 28-20, uh, Central Florida 2-1. Parker for Oklahoma, she hit an RBI double. Number three, Tennessee beat number 17, Alabama 2-0. Tennessee's West, solo home run, Pickens, she struck out seven Alabama batters. Number five, Duke beat 27 and 22, NC State 6 to 1. Number 20, Arizona beat number six, UCLA 8 to 4. Number 10, Washington beat number eight, Stanford 3 to 1. Number three, Arkansas beat number seven, LSU 4 to 1. Both teams had seven hits in that game. Uh, number nine, Georgia beat number 12, Florida 11 to 6. Georgia's uh, Kuma, RBI triple, and a two run home run, Kearney. Hit a three-run home run in that game. Number 14, Missouri beat number 18, Mississippi State, 4 to nothing. Missouri's, Missouri's Laird, RBI double. Number 16, Florida State beat 30 and 18, uh, North Carolina, 11 to 3. Uh, even though they scored three, North Carolina just still had nine hits in that game. Number 15, Virginia Tech beat 24 and 21, Syracuse, 7 to 3. 26 and 22, Louisville. Beat number 21, Clemson, 6-3. Number 19, Louisiana beat UNL Monroe, one to nothing. UL Monroe, one hit in that game. Uh, number 24, Texas State beat Southern Miss, 2-1, to one, despite having two errors. Both teams have nine hits in that game. Number 22, Kentucky beat 31-18, South Carolina, 3-1. Uh, Kentucky's Nesby, RBI double. Smith hit an RBI triple for Kentucky. 31-9 Northwestern beat 27 and 21 Nebraska, 8 to 1. Uh, Nebraska was winning the second game, 5 to nothing. Then it got suspended, I'm guessing, due to the bad weather. Uh 19, 26 Arizona State beat number 25 Cal, 5 to 4. Cal committed two errors in that game. Uh 36 and 14, Michigan beat 33 and 14, Penn State 14 to 3. 26 and 21, Boston College beat 26 and 21 Notre Dame, 10 to 9. Uh, BC's Siegel, she had two solo home runs and an RBI double. Nice game for her. Uh, 31-19, Rutgers beat Michigan State 9-4. 18-27, Wisconsin beat 36-14, and 14, Indiana 8-6. Indiana had seven hits, two errors in that game. 24-25, Houston beat 27-17, and 17, Texas Tech 8-0. Texas Tech only had one hit. 29-17, Ohio State beat Illinois 13-5 in five innings. 31-17, Virginia beat 31-21, Georgia Tech 16-1. Georgia Tech only had two hits in that game. 27-23, Ole Miss beat 25-16, Auburn 4-2. Ole Miss's Lopez struck out eight Auburn batters. 28-25, uh, Oregon State beat 29-19, Utah 6-3 despite it committing three errors. Moving on to Sunday baseball. Uh, number 24, South Carolina, beat number 4, Kentucky, 10 to nothing in seven innings. They win the series. Uh, USC's Petrie and Jones hit two run singles each. Number 6, Duke, beat number 10, Florida State, 16 to 4. Florida State still wins the series. 
Uh, number seven, East Carolina beat Memphis 8-3. East Carolina swept that series. 29-15, Mississippi State beat number 11, Vanderbilt 8-7. Mississippi State wins that series. 22-20, uh, and 20, Notre Dame beat number eight, Wake Forest 8-7. Notre Dame ends up winning that series. Uh, Notre Dame, Spence, Baumgart, and Williams. All his solo home runs in that game. 27-14, Virginia Tech beats number 15, North Carolina, 4-3. North Carolina still wins that series. Uh, Troy beat number 13, Coastal Carolina, 15-3 in seven innings. Troy swept that whole series. 26-18, Texas beat number 18, Oklahoma, 8-6. And then won the second game, 12-10 in seven innings, I'm guessing because of the weather. OU takes that first game. Texas comes back, wins the second, second third. Uh, number 17, Louisiana, beating Southern Miss 13 to 7. 32 total hits between both those teams in this game. Uh, Louisiana wins the series. Uh, 25 and 18, Indiana beat 24 and 19. Rutgers 8 to 6. 18 to 6, I'm sorry, in seven innings. IU, Indiana sweeps that series. Number 21, NC State beat Ball State 11 to 3. Uh, North Carolina State's Butterworth, two-run home run, and an RBI double. Uh, let's see. Oh, NC State swept that series. A lot of sweeps this weekend. 28-17, Maryland beat 25-15, Illinois, 11-7. Maryland, they won that series. 26-16, West Virginia beat Baylor, 13-4. West Virginia's Hussey had a two-run home run. King had a two-run double. West Virginia sweeps Baylor. Uh, 25 and 19, Cincinnati beat 26 and 15, Central Florida, 8 to 2. Cincinnati won the series. 25 and 15, Kansas beat 29 and 17, Texas Tech, 7 to 3. Um, how do you say this guy's name? Kansas is uh, Shijonga? Shijonga? So, no, I'm butchering his name. Uh, uh, yeah, anyway, three run double. Nice. Uh, Kansas swept that series. Number five, Clemson beat 25 and 18. Louisville 17 to 7 to win that series. Uh, Clemson's hinder leader, two run home run, three run double, and an RBI single. Man. Talk about a party for him when they when they go back to Clemson. Uh, number 12, UC Irvine beat UC Riverside 12 to 3. UCI sweeps that series. 27 to 17, Georgia Tech beat Miami 17 to 1, won the series. Uh, Miami, only one hit in that entire game. Uh, Georgia Tech's Geisler hit a three-run and a solo home run in that one. 29-15, Purdue beat Northwestern 11-3. Purdue sweeps Northwestern. 21-22, Auburn beat 28-17. LSU 7-5. LSU did have 13 strikeouts, so nice pitching for them. Uh, and they end up winning the series, too. Uh, they needed to. They needed that win. Uh, 29-13, Utah beat UCLA 12-7, despite committing two errors. Both teams have 13 hits in that game. Utah sweeps UCLA. Uh, 13 innings, Washington beat number 16, Arizona 9-8. Washington won the series. Number 22, Oregon beat number 9, Oregon State 7-1. Oregon State wins the series. Number 25, Indiana State beat Southern Illinois 7-2. Indiana State won the series, which they needed to, because they are barely hanging in the top 25. Uh, no top 25 games last night from baseball, but BYU played, and they did beat Abilene Christian 8-6. to six. And rounding it out, Sunday, so I got water on my table. Sunday in softball, number two, Oklahoma, beat Central Florida 11-3, or 11-7. Oklahoma's Parker hit two run and solo home runs. Nice game for her. OU sweep that series. Number 17, Bama beat number three, Tennessee, one to nothing. Tennessee did win the series. Um, they only had two hits in that game. That's crazy. Number four, Oklahoma State beat Kansas nine to one in five innings. Oklahoma State swept that series. Number five, Duke beat NC State five to three. Duke sweeps the series. Number seven, LSU beat number 13, Arkansas, one to nothing. But Arkansas still won, won the series. Number eight, Stanford beat number 10, Washington, two to one. Stanford won that series. Uh, okay, here we go. We're talking about Oklahoma and Texas baseball. Here's the crazy thing about Florida, Georgia, if you did not see the game on Sunday. Uh, number 12, Florida beat Georgia 10-7. You say, okay. 
Seventh inning, Georgia was up four to three. Florida on their last out of the game. One more out, Georgia wins. Last out of the game, they score seven runs. I mean, Georgia, the pitching fell apart. Uh, even some of the defensive play fell apart. They were able, Florida was able to score seven runs in the seventh inning with that one out remaining. Totally crazy. And to add even more crazy, um, it was four to three. But Georgia, you know, playing at home, they got the last bat. They started scoring runs. They started down to their last out, basically, scoring four runs. I was like, holy crap, they're going to make a comeback and win this thing? Nope. Didn't do it. Florida ended up 10-7. Uh, Georgia won the series. And I think I saw something crazy about Georgia hasn't won a Georgia-Florida series in softball in quite a few years. But, uh, yeah, had them at 4-3, to three, down to that last out, just couldn't get it, and Florida just piled on the runs. Uh, totally crazy, crazy, crazy-ass game. Uh, if you didn't see it, uh, it was crazy. All right, anyway, back to it. Number 14, Missouri beat number 18, Mississippi State, 4-1. to one. 25 and 21 Syracuse beat number 15 Virginia Tech 6 to 2. Syracuse won that series. Uh, number 16 Florida State beat 30 and 19 uh, UNC 2 to 1. UNC did have six more hits in that game, but Florida State still swept them. Number 19 Louisiana beat UNL Monroe 5 to 2. UNL Monroe only two hits. They only hit three. They've only had three hits in the last two games. UL, UNL Monroe has. That's crazy. Uh, Louisiana sweeps that series. Number 21, Clemson beat Louisville late, 11 to 5. Clemson still won the series. Uh, 32 18, South Carolina beat number 22, Kentucky, 3 to nothing. 23, number 23, Oregon beat uh, Northern Colorado, 9 to 2. Number 24, Texas State beat Southern Miss, 4 to 3. Despite uh, Southern Miss have, having more hits, Texas State won that series. Number 25, Cal beat Arizona State, 7 to 2. Cal won that series. 28-17, Texas Tech beat Houston 5-2. Uh, Texas Tech's Holloman <laughs> stole third base on a third on a uh, on a throwing error, runs it into home, scores on there. Texas Tech wins the series. Uh 31-22, Georgia Tech lost to 32-17 Virginia, 4-3. Virginia won the series. Uh 28-23, Ole Miss beat 25-17 Auburn, 7-2. Ole Miss wins the series. Ole Miss's Furbush and Rummel and uh, Rummel each hit two run home runs in that one. 37 to 14, Michigan beat 33 and 15 Penn State 3 to 2. Michigan sweeps the series. 17 and 30, Michigan State beat 31 to 20. Rutgers 4 to 1. Rutgers, they still won the series. 19 and 27, Wisconsin beat 36 and 15. Indiana 7 to 1. Wisconsin won that series. 27 and 21 Boston College beat 26 and 22 Notre Dame 6 to 3. Uh, BC wins that series. Siegel for BC. She hit a two run single in that game. Uh, 20 and 28 Illinois beat 29 and 18 Ohio State 11 to 6. Buckeyes still won the series. 25 and 22 Minnesota beat Iowa 6 to 2. 30 and 19 Utah beat Oregon State 5 to nothing. Oregon State won the series. Number six UCLA beat number 20 Arizona 11 to 7. UCLA won the series. Uh, yesterday, Minnesota beat Iowa 5 to 1. And uh, number 8, Mississippi State beat number 14, Missouri 3 to 2 to end up in those, those series. And number 8, Stanford beat Seattle 5 to 3. That is it. We'll be back later in the week with any upsets that happened uh, from tonight on the Thursday. Probably do the show Friday. Uh, again, got family coming in this next weekend too. So probably won't do a show until Monday. Maybe Sunday afternoon, more likely probably Monday. But anyway, been back Friday. Go over news and upsets and stuff like that. It happened. Uh, stay busy. The week will go by fast. Before you know it, the weekend will be here again. We'll see you next time.